nice and gloomy. It's good to have a gloomy day every now and then, but not all the time. But looks like the sun's gonna peek out a little bit over there. So what we found out was inside of the inside of the wire is a male connection, but it is supposed to be a female. So we just pulled it off. Morning. Best way to check if your panel is charging. And when it's off charging, that little sun will turn into like a moon. And that arrow will turn off. Even with a cloudy day, it'll still pull power. Not a lot, but just enough. So, pretty cool. That's why I like the LED water pump switch. It's blue. It's raining here. Got the Harv. This time he's not going to touch any cactuses. <laughs> not this time. <laughs> nice wet roads. Yeah, we got that house completed. It charges now. Terminal connection was wrong, so it wasn't making a positive connection. Now it's charging, now it's working. Raining in Navajo Mountain. Truck got muddy, but now the truck got clean. Me and Stanley were leaving the house, about to hit the main road. Ty and Rob were behind us, and what did we do? Oh, we picked up tanks. We were heading back, and we got to Holiday Water. Almost by the Arizona warehouse. Okay. And I was talking to Stanley, I was like, you've seen uh, the new James Bond, right? He was like, no. And I was like, really? He was like, yeah. I was like, I asked him, I was like, what was the last one that you watched? I was like, something about a lady covered in oil. I was like, oh, uh, Quantum of Solace. He's like, yeah. And I looked at him. So you haven't seen the new, the very recent new one. He's like, no. He's like, what happened in there? I was like, you want me to spoil it for you? He's like, I don't care. And I was like, okay. James Bond died. He's like, oh. I was like, no, I'm serious. He died. He's like, yeah, right. I was like, I pulled out my phone. I pulled it, I pulled it up on uh, YouTube and I showed it. And he's all like, watching it, driving, watching. And I was like, Stanley, stop. And he stops. And he like really watched the whole thing and then he sees that bomb drop. <laughs> and I was laughing at it. I was like, I, I think I just uh, crushed your soul right there. <laughs> and his eyes is, you know, James Bond never dies. Yeah. And here I just killed that childhood thought. <laughs> so Harvin beat me to the punch on saying there's, there's probably a UFO up there. <laughs> Definitely. So Harvin jinxed it. He was like, it's probably not even raining up to there. It's raining hard where we were. So as soon as we got to like a certain spot, it stopped raining. Not dry, but it's just it stopped. Did you pass it? Is it out? Pretty sure, yeah. This is the 120 volt system power strip 
water heater. Just the same as the others. Expansion tank. Water filter. And we use their existing drainage. So, nice hot water. Just plugs right in and it's good to go. And this is the 120 volt type system. Not sure if I added this in any of the videos. And uh, this is a lot simpler, a lot easier. It's really quick. I don't have to drill that big six inch hole tank. And yeah, it's this is very, very simple. A lot of it's just prepping the fittings and then bolts up right on the wall. So just like the other houses, next one's just right next door. And we're gonna start on that. Coolest things about coming to some of these homes is you see some cool, cool, cool stuff. Like there's one in Shanto that is a very, very old sawmill or it's a saw that cuts like big timber to make them into like two by fours and stuff. If you've seen the movie Johnny Cash, the one with uh, Joaquin Phoenix where his little brother, his older brother fell into the blade, just like that, it's sitting outside. And then this is an old wagon. That's pretty cool. So it did end up raining on us rained quite a bit when we were loading the uh, the work truck it started raining we had our tarps on there and then we flipped the guys flipped it over like that got it all nice and covered still got wet but yeah it started raining on us in Navajo Mountain it was pretty cool and was able the guys were able to get two homes hooked up using their existing sink using existing drainage so cool when they get to see that faucet turn on with water coming out got the place locked down just doing last minute checks and hopefully everything is locked so funny thing is you know I had the backhoe loaded up with five tanks and then I thought oh shoot how are we gonna get the get the backhoe down there? So I had the guys push the tanks off, loaded the backhoe on the trailer. I hope you guys enjoy it. Haven't done a time lapse like that in a while. Usually I do a time lapse like that when I go from Navajo Mountain to Shanto or Shanto to Navajo Mountain. And the first one I did was Cameron. We uh, did an install in Cameron over there. It was pretty, it was a training install and then Starting our work at Shanto, we needed to get that backhoe up here, use that to pull it, and yeah, this is my first time time lapsing it. Made a video, it's on the Dig Deep Facebook. You can probably find it through their video stuff, and that's when I started getting a little too into video, video editing stuff like that. For this channel, 
I don't really like to add music to it anymore. I like to hear the naturalness of, you know, the world. So when I do either my morning drives or when I'm here in the morning, I like to keep it nice and quiet, sunrise, anything like that. Or when I'm looking at the landscapes and stuff, you like to keep it quiet, keep it original, no music to get in the way. And yeah, tomorrow we got another two installs, roughly in the same area. Same thing, 120 volt system. It's gonna be smooth, quick, easy, we're gonna get it done. So, with that said, I will see you guys in the next one.